What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video I'll be showing you how to draw the Renegade Raider from Fortnite. Let's start in the center of our page with the eyes. We're going to start on the left side with a circle. Starting from the very top. Work our way around to the bottom. And then back up towards the top. Now leave a gap in the center and draw the same thing on the right. So we're going to line up the top of the circle. Come down to the same height. And then back up towards the top. And we want to add a highlight circle along the top left of each eye. So up against the edge of the eye on the left, curve around and back out. And we'll line this up on the right and do the same thing. Now let's fill the inside area of the eyes in black. Now we want to move down and draw that strip of paint going across the nose. So we're going to start underneath the left eye, we're going to draw a curve going up the middle and then back down on the right. Now let's flatten off the ends with a short line. Now we're just going to trace that same curve going across. Let's fill that strip in black. We're also going to add a shorter strip in the center. So we're going to draw a short line going across, go up the sides, and then close off the top. And then again we'll fill that area in black. Now we're going to move down in the center and draw the tip of the nose. Over on the left we're going to curve down and back up underneath that strip. Let's move down again and draw in the mouth. Over on the left side we're going to draw a curve. Coming down and back up. Let's draw on the upper lip. In the center, we're going to step up, start with a point. From this point, we're going to angle up and out toward the left and then the right. And then from the top, we're going to curve down and then out towards the corners of the mouth. Let's draw on the lower lip. Back on the left side, we're going to curve down in the middle and then back up on the right. Let's add that strip of paint coming down the center of the lip. Over on the left side, we're going to draw a straight line coming down, just overlapping the bottom of the lip. Do the same thing on the right. Close off the bottom, and we'll fill that inside area in black. Now I'm going to move back up and draw the inside edge of the hat. Over on the left side, we're going to draw a curve going up, and then back down on the right. Now we're going to tuck the eyebrows in underneath the edge of the hat. Starting on the left side, curve in and then down. Line this up on the right. We're going to do the same thing. And from the inside, we're going to draw a short angled line going up and in. And we're going to follow that same curve going up and out in behind the hat. Let's fill the eyebrows in black. I'm going to draw a little bit of hair coming down in the center of the forehead. In the middle, curve down and then out towards the right eye. And then we're just going to taper that back up. Let's draw a smaller one over to the left side. Curve down and in. And we'll taper that back up. Now we're going to go back to the side. We're going to draw on the flaps coming down the side of the head. Starting on the left side, we're going to come down. And we're just going to bend that in. Do the same thing on the right. Coming straight down and then bending that in. Let's round out the bottom. We're like drawing a half circle, going back up. Now let's draw on the bottom of the head. In line with the mouth, we're going to step over towards the left side, curve down underneath the mouth, and pull that back up on the right. Go back to the flaps. We're going to draw a straight line going up the side of the head. I'm just going to stop right about there. Do the same thing on the right. Go straight up to the same height. From here, we're going to draw on the bottom edge of the goggles. 
From the left side, we're gonna draw a straight angled line going up and into right about there. We'll do the same thing on the right. So we're gonna line this up and go down and out. From the inside, we're gonna angle up and in, leaving a gap in the center. And we'll close out the middle with a straight line. Now from the center, we're gonna step down, start with a point. From here, we're gonna curve down and then back up underneath the goggle on the left. Come down, just up above the edge of the hat. Go back to the center. Do the same thing on the right. Let's go back to the outside. We draw a short angle line going up and out. Now I'm just gonna pull this in with a straight line towards this point. And do the same thing on the right. Then we're going to go back to the center. From the inside, we're going to draw two short lines going up. And we'll close off the inside with a straight line. Now from the top corners, I want to draw a straight line going across, lined up with this point on the left. Straight across to right about there. And we're just going to pull this straight down towards the bottom. Let's do the same thing on the right. Going straight across. And line up with the outside point and then come straight down. Let's trace the goggles out on the inside. So from the top corner we're going to step down, going in, come down with a short line, down with an angle, then all the way down towards the bottom corner. We'll do the same thing on the right. Now let's draw on the top of the head. From the top corner, we're gonna step in, draw a half circle, curving up towards the top of the head, and then back down on the right side. Let's add a thick stripe in the center of the head. Moving over towards the left, draw one line, and then we'll do the same thing on the right. Now I'm just gonna add a trim along the bottom and inside edge of the hat. So let's start over on the left side. I'm just gonna follow that same curve going around, the top. Now we're going to curve across in behind the goggle, in between, and then we'll continue over on the right side. And we're going to blend this out toward the right. Now we're going to move down and draw on the sides of the body. Over on the left side, we're going to curve out and down towards the hip. Go to the right and do the same thing. Now let's connect the hips with a curve. Going down and then up. Let's step up, draw that same curve for the top of the belt. Now let's add the buckle. Leaving a gap in the center, we draw two lines on either side. One on the left and then one on the right. And then we're going to move over and add a belt loop. So two lines beside each other on either side. We're going to add a trim across the body. Starting from the left, curve down and then back up. Now step up and draw on the collar. Over on the left side, curve down and up. Now add a strap going across the chest. Starting from the left, go straight across, step down, draw that twice. And then we'll add one dog tag in the center. Start with a straight line going across the top, come down the sides, and then across the bottom. Now at the top of this rectangle, I'm going to curve out and up underneath the head. We'll do the same thing on the right side. Let's add in the shoulder strap. From the top of the body, we'll step out, curve out, and pull that in towards the side of the body. I'm going to continue working down with the legs. So in the center, we'll move down and draw a curve from left to right, going up and then back down. Leaving a gap in the center, we'll go to the left side, curve out and down towards the left heel, go to the right, curve out and down towards the right heel. Now we're going to round out the bottom of the feet. Starting from the heel, curve down and up towards the toe, do the same thing on the right. Now let's round out the top of the foot. Starting from the toe, we're going to curve up, 
I'm going to bend this down, aiming towards the heel. And then we'll thicken up the sole. Taking this curve, step up, and I'm just going to trace that going across. Now I'm going to move back up to the hip and draw on the side of the leg. Starting from the left hip, I'm going to curve out, round up the leg, and then pull that in towards the top of the foot. Now I'm going to add a shin guard on top of the right leg. So starting about halfway down the side of the leg, go straight out, come down with an angle, and then come straight down on top of the foot. I just want to trace that out on the inside. Let's add the edge of the boot. From the foot, we'll step up, draw a curve, coming down, and then up. We'll line this up on the right, we'll go in behind the shin guard. Then we'll add the strap. Step down, draw that same curve. Now I'm going to add a strap across the left thigh. So we'll start on the outside, we're going to curve down and then in. Step down, and then draw that twice. And then we're going to add a hip pad over on the right side. Come down in an angle. We're going to follow the same curve of the leg, coming down just up above the shin guard, and we'll straight out. Then let's add that strap. On the inside of the leg, curve out and up, step down, and draw that curve twice. Now let's move up and draw on the arms. We're going to start just up above the bottom of the strap, on the left side we're going to curve out and down towards the wrist. Line this up on the right, and do the same thing. Now back on the left side, let's start with the thumb. We draw a small half circle, coming in and then back out. And then from the bottom of the thumb, I'm going to curve up and in towards the wrist. Let's do the same thing on the right. Draw that half circle, and curve up and in. Now we're going to add three fingers on either side. So we're going to start underneath the thumb, curve down and up the first finger. We'll step down, curve down and up the second finger. And then from this side, we're just going to curve the arm going all the way up in behind the head. Go out. And we're just going to pull that in. Let's do the same thing on the right. Let's separate out the fingers of the glove. We start with the index finger, curve down up towards the thumb. Separate out the second, and then the third. And then we're going to add the edge of the glove. From the wrist, we'll step up, curve up, and then out. Line this up on the left side, curve up, and out. Let's add a couple armbands. From this curve, we'll step up. I'm just going to trace that same curve going across towards the inside. And let's add an armband across the top. From the top of the arm, Curve up and out, step up, curve this in behind the strap. Let's add the bandage over the right arm. Step up and trace that curve going across. And from the top, we're going to curve down diagonally towards the bottom corner. And then halfway along this curve, we're going to go out and down towards the opposite corner. Now the last thing I'm going to do is add the tip of the ponytail coming out on the right side. So underneath the head, curve down, and then out. I'm just going to taper this back in behind the arm, and that's pretty much it. There's the Renegade Raider from Fortnite. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe, and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon.